Hi guys, welcome to my first YouTube vlog. I'm super excited to start this journey with you guys. In this video, I'll be showing you items that I bought for my kitchen. So it's a mini kitchen haul. I will be curating pieces with time um, for my kitchen, for the rest of my house. And I'll be happy to show you guys my journey and Consider hitting the subscription button if you'd like to see more of my videos, like this video. And uh, let me show you what I got, a sneak peek of what I got from one of the places I went to, and that's Kamkunji. A friend of mine took me there. I was not too familiar with the place, but I was so happy when she told me when we could go. So one of the pieces I got are these measuring cups. Uh, these were 250 shillings. Kamkunji had really, really colorful pieces, which um, I was really set in my mind to get them in black or white, but mainly black. So if you know where I can get this in black, preferably, kindly comment below and let me know where I can get them. I'd highly appreciate it. So the shop where I got those measuring cups from was New Cook's Companion Kitchenware. And the other item I got for my kitchen is this sieve. It's a metallic mesh sieve. And I really love the wooden detail on the handle. And this as well was 250 shillings. I'm told that it does a better job than the plastic version I have, so I can't wait to try it out. This I got from a shop that's called Navcar K Limited, and they were super nice. So, in I'd like to let you guys see the rest of the video and see the pieces that I got. I'm looking forward to you guys hearing from you subscribe like share and let's grow this channel let's get into the video this is the cutlery section i decided to window shop at shoprite supermarket at the same time grab a few pieces i'd like to start off with identify the brands and pieces i'd like to buy and plan for those that i'll buy with time once i get the money for them Definitely cutlery is not that cheap if you're looking for good quality pieces So you definitely have to save up if you're on a budget But hey, if you have the money, why not just buy once and once and for all As for me, I do have to save my coins I'm loving this cheese board and the cheese set Like this is a set to die for Do you guys look at the place or country where an item has been made i do take my time having some countries are known for their great workmanship product design and so on this inspects my choices when it comes to buying household items in general let me know if you guys actually take your time and do all that because hey when I am shopping and or window shopping, I love to take my time and just identify what pieces I'd like and buy or save up. So one of the places I went to is, I know you guys can tell, is Mr. Price. I really, really love Mr. Price, but they can be a bit pricey. So these are just pieces that I loved and I took my time to just think about it and save up for or I just bought impulse buying. So first things first, um, I'm going to show you guys the this. They are candle holders. Um, this was going for 300 shillings. And I really, really love this color. Like, I fell in love with it. Um, I just thought I can find other ways to use it apart from just using it as a candle holder. I'm going to be innovative with this right now. I'll see what I'll do. So, since I didn't want to get just one, I decided to get two. Uh, 
piece I got is this beautiful jar. I, it's more of a vase, see? And um, this was just 150 shillings. I don't know if you guys can see that. But I really, really loved how, I don't know, can we call it ombre? feeling like um the color it's not as translucent but not uh, i don't know i just loved and also the other thing i love about mr price is how they like bubble wrap their glass pieces like it's so much of a good thing because sometimes if you're shopping like you're having a lot of things you're buying and then it's not carefully wrapped you can get home and just find that something broke and that's so annoying when you have spent money and your time on something. So I wish this is something like supermarket would do. Just bubble wrap glass, like anything breakable. So this and this, this is more of a like a say black or some shade of blue and this is like a really nice green so I thought I'd get two of this this was also the same price uh, 150 shillings so they had different shades um, and there are others that are just clear glass but I wasn't a fan of that so maybe I might change my mind I don't know So that's all that I got for Mr. Price in terms of kitchenware. Uh, the other place I went to shop at is Carrefour. And this, I must say, was more of <laughs> impulse buying, actually more of influence. Because I would told a friend of mine, Katie, um, that i was looking for some like to upgrade my kitchen and just feel bougie in my kitchen and all so she was shopping at carrefour and then sent me a picture of this and i just fell in love with the detail and how it looks and i could just imagine myself like sipping uh whatever in this either juice or just my um anything that i make strawberry shake or whatever but i just felt <laughs> this is so cool so i thought instead of taking one let me just take two i might add more pieces but then i saw a good deal at um shop right where you can get this i think six of them plus a, a dispenser glass dispenser jar so i'm thinking i might save up and buy that instead instead of buying one one piece of this but i'll i'll think about it but yeah can you imagine myself mm, definitely anything i drink out of this will test way better and i got myself this brand of honey i don't know i just love the packaging then it's glass. So I thought of different ways I'd reuse this glass once it's over. So I can't wait for that. I'll show you guys. But also, apart from that, um, I've never actually tried this type of honey. So I hope it's worth it. But yes, it is in terms of I get the glass, but uh, we'll see. So I can't wait to try. I'll let you guys know how this went. The other place I shopped at was, oh, sorry, I forgot to tell you guys, uh, this was around 230 or 240 shillings, which will be like $2. Um, the other place I shopped at is ShopRite. So, <sighs> I needed a greater so bad can you believe i don't have like one of this what i have is um 
some other version that um, has a container and I, I really 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 don't like it as much like it's it's served me for a while but um, let me show you guys <laughs> this is the one that I'm talking about like uh, no because I grate and then everything is like stored in here but well it has served me but I just feel like I need to upgrade you know and um, yeah so at least when I'm using this I'm gonna feel a bit um, bougie while I'm cooking for myself so this is the pro chef brand Mm, let's see and I think I bought this at um, do I have the receipt? yes I do this was 490 shillings 490 shillings which is uh, four dollars and ninety cents so I really really loved how it is and it's also like stainless steel so I was actually looking for the ones that have like a, a storage at the bottom but I couldn't remember where I saw them if you know what I'm talking about please comment below and let me know which where I can get that greater I'm not sure if I had seen them on Jumia or uh, what was it come for I just don't know where I saw a grater like this and then at the bottom it has like storage where uh, once you grate like the whatever you grated remains in the, in the storage and that storage you, you like use it now to like dip in your frying pan or whatever <sighs> so the other things I got for this Fox, like I couldn't help myself I decided to settle on this brand because it's called autograph premium series um, it just looks classy and I think I'm just gonna have fun and I just love the shape the shape of the fork and oh, I feel like my food is gonna be more yummy <laughs> I needed this. This fox was 598, 588 shillings, sorry. Um four four pieces. For me, it's a good spend. Then the I needed some stick knives. Um I was a bit bummed that there were just two. But I think I'll just go slowly like buying and so that I have a couple. The same with this because I don't think I only need four. I'll need more than that uh, when I start hosting like more people. Because currently where I am, it's a bit, the house is a bit small so I can't entertain a, a large number of group. Like a number of people, um, it's just not comfortable because the house is a bit small. But once I move to a bigger space, I think I'm going to have an entertainment space. So, this stick knives, I couldn't help myself. So, I got this. I just got one. It's a set of two. So, I just took one packet. Um, I've already told you the price. So, the next thing I got myself was the spoons. Uh, this again. I loved the shape of this. Um, I just couldn't help myself. Um, these are four dessert spoons, just from the same brand Autograph. Can you guys like sh see the shape of this? Uh, this is so 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 pretty. Um, this is also something else that um, came in four pieces, so I definitely would need to like add more. And get another pack like this or four so I, ha I have uh, like eight or like my target is to have 12 of each or 
maybe six or eight but since i i don't think this will work in terms of six so maybe eight yeah this were going for 588 shillings and 67 cents so that's still like five dollars then i got these teaspoons which are also a pack of four same brand autograph i really really loved the shape of them oh so pretty so definitely this um i will need to add more but what else i loved about this brand is like the at the back they give you like how to take care of the pieces you bought so there's even warning um let's see like how to clean it um if you can like use uh what type of ingredient you can use like when cleaning the pieces so i'm really really impressed i wish like all brands would do that so we know we, we like avoid having scratch marks or i know cutlery just doesn't look pretty that's it so that's all i got myself and i will be accumulating more pieces um i'll just be taking my time and finally i'll just have like all the items that i need i'm really really super happy to walk with you with this journey and um i just want to feel more at home like i want this place to be inviting i want to be in my kitchen and just love cooking and just improve on my cooking and improve on my presentation and all and all this just comes with the environment that you're in like if you're in a space that's encouraging you to like do more and have fun while at it then you're definitely gonna be up in your game in just everything like you're gonna come home you're gonna come to your kitchen and just be happy and you know when you're entertaining you're also proud with the things that you're presenting like the cutlery people are gonna use the it's just fun for you and for the, your people you that you're gonna be entertaining so i just felt it was high time like i needed to upgrade from the items that i had before which i'm gonna show you in upcoming videos as we do small makeovers which i plan to do i need to redo the kitchen and the whole house paint it the landlord color because as i told you guys earlier i want to move out of this house but due to corona um i i'm not too sure because i'm no longer on a payroll so that might be tricky but i just want in time i get an opportunity um to move out and also to like um have extra source of income and all i definitely definitely want to move into a bigger house but as i wait i'm thinking let me prepare my space so that if i get an opportunity and i get a, a, a bigger house i don't want to be like oh, i'm not done with this house like i still need to you know like i just and i understand that um I need to make sure that I get my deposit back but this place uh, apparently we don't we're not given deposits back like they find excuses so what I want to do is just make over my space and um, sit on my deposit like a typical Kenyan and I'm not ashamed I am gonna sit on my deposit and I'm gonna make over this space the same paint even if I didn't find the space painted but I will do that so that I don't need drama when I'm moving out. Thanks guys for watching my channel. Feel free to subscribe, comment below, let me know what you think of the items I bought so far, any suggestions you have. Um, thank you also for just taking your time and watching this video. I really appreciate it and I wish we could grow the channel. Subscribing is Free, totally free of charge uh, we grow as a family we grow as a uh, we grow together as a tribe in this YouTube channel so I want you guys to like um, subscribe I want you to like this video give it a thumbs up share with your friends and family 
support my work so that I can keep posting more content for you guys and we can grow together. Thank you for your time and I'm just super super happy. Till the next video, bye.